So anyway, uh, I'm going to put all this up and we'll be right back with the rest of the stuff. Just a second. Okay, before I forget, we got some litter, kitty dry. I believe it's 20 pounds for $4.79. That's cheaper than Walmart. That's where we usually get it. Uh, we've got some at Kroger. It's about $6 for the cheapest one there. So that's not too bad. And also I got some... Uh, these paper towels, uh, six of them for $4.99, that's not bad. It says six big rolls equals 12 regular rolls. Well, you know, come on. They do have quite a few in them though, 125 sheets, and they're actually pretty good. It's, uh, what's it called, cardinal tissue. So, that's not bad. I already had enough facial tissue, you know, Kleenex, where I got that at Dollar Tree. And I got, uh, if you remember, I got like a 16 roll, thousand count roll uh, uh, toilet paper of great value at Walmart. And we got, like I said, we got a lot of great markdowns this time. I always look at them, but they don't always have things that I really want, you know. And they had this um, Campbell Slow Kettle style creamy tomato with a crunch. Uh, have you ever tried this slow kettle style ones of uh, of Campbell's? They're really good. And these used to be $1.49 and then they were marked down to uh, 75 cents. So half price. Uh, if you price one of these, they're ridiculously high. Um, I'm thinking these were like $3 and something. I'm not kidding. Uh, I, I mean, I could be, maybe it was the little bigger ones, but. Uh, I know these are very expensive to where I wouldn't, we wouldn't buy these regular price in a store. They're just not worth, you know, worth it. So, so yeah, they got these little things in the top, little crackers, I guess. They look like, kind of like uh, oyster crackers. So I got us one each of those. You know, we could have us a grilled cheese sandwich or something with it, you know, or some type of sandwich. Uh, it's going to start getting cooler before you know it. It'll be... Uh, because now sometimes it stays uh, pretty warm here for quite a long time and the way it's been when it's been so much warmer I'm afraid it's going to be that way till probably November or something just guessing we'll see how it goes as time goes on we got this uh, these Mio Logan really likes those with his uh, waters you know and this one's berry pomegranate we got two of them because they're just a dollar a piece um, I'm thinking these are two or three bucks. I mean, about three, I believe, uh, if you look for them at Walmart or something. So a dollar is really good. There's another one somewhere. Uh, we got Ocean Spray Jelly Cranberry Sauce. We've got some of the uh, whole berry for the next time I make uh, cranberry chicken, which I'm thinking about it makes me want to have it now. I don't have any thought out, but... Yeah. We always, you know, try to keep one of each, and it was just a dollar. That's not bad. It's, they're pretty high now uh, for stuff like that. Um, this one is, uh, I didn't realize, I didn't see the Duncan Hines uh, logo on here. My goodness, I, I just thought it was some brand, like an off-brand. This is Duncan Hines Wilderness More Fruit Cherry Pie Filling and Topping, 10% more fruit. Now that I know it's Duncan Hines, I wish we'd have bought more. They got a bunch of them, and they, it was $1.99, and now they got them marked down to uh, $1.29. It's not bad. They make a good uh, cherry cheesecake. That's what I should make. I got everything to make it. Ooh, a, a cherry streusel pie, everybody. Look at that. I don't know if you could see that enough to take a snapshot of that. It's the way it's curved. I don't know if you can see everything. But anyway, pause that and see if you think you can see that. But uh, that's a great buy. I mean, all, all pie fillings now are, seems like they're around three bucks or something, you know, at least at Kroger. I don't think I've looked for them at Walmart. 
Okay, we'll have to try this on something uh, on one of Logan's shows uh, when he has some popcorn of some kind. Not sweet popcorn, but it's Orville Redenbacher's Ranch Popcorn Seasoning. I imagine you could probably use that on other things too, but, uh, you know, I'm going to see what it's like. Uh, I might mention it anyway. Uh, but anyway, it was, uh, I think it was a dollar. Let's mark down. It was, it was a dollar ninety nine, and we got it for a dollar. So we got some really great markdowns today. Okay, um, I don't think we've tried this one before. Um, I would have got. Uh, they had several flavors of these Pringles, and they had one that was lightly salted, but the cans were all busted in. I mean, you know, had dents in them, and I was afraid they probably crunched up, you know, on the inside or something. So I didn't get that one. Uh, they were dollar seventy nine, which isn't an amazing price, but it is cheaper than they are at Kroger. Or I don't know about Walmart. Yeah, I think they're like a dollar ninety eight or something at Walmart. The last time I got one, but it's a pizza one. So I thought we would try this on Logan's show. It probably has a good September three. Oh, of twenty twenty five. Oh man. I wonder what they would really taste like if you had them on September 2nd of 2025. I'll bet they wouldn't taste the same as they do right now, just my opinion. You know, that's a long time. I thought it was this September. Yeah, it's coming September. Okay, they don't have both of these in here, but they had these in the ad too, and I'm kind of uh, going to be wanting to try this. You know, I don't know if. I'll probably have to try them one on morning coffee break, I think. It's Hostess. You know, they're making everything out of all kinds of stuff these days. Cereal, all kinds of... But anyway, you know, they had Twinkies uh, latte or whatever it was. Twinkie, uh, Twinkies iced coffee. Remember that? And Ding Dong. I tried that one, too. Coffee. Well, now they got Twinkies pudding. <laughs> and guess what? They're just a dollar... And I guarantee you, I don't know, what, what brand makes this? I wonder if Snack Pack makes this. I don't have my regular glasses in here. Uh, Advanced Food Products. Hostess Brands. So, I don't think, you know, the people that... I, I don't think this is the same as Snack Pack pudding. But I guarantee you they would be way more than a dollar. So there's the Twinkies one. We got another one here somewhere. Joy so got C4 Smart Energy Zero Sugar. This one's Blood Orange for 50 cents. I know these are expensive too. All these energy drinks at regular price are expensive. And I got two of these. I was waiting for them to mark these down. I was hoping they would. Uh, it's this is the size, I hope this isn't the regular size now for um, for breadcrumbs. Just look, look how small. I've got a bigger one up there from Aldi. That's, you know, it's it's bigger around and it's about like that tall. So anyway, these were a dollar to begin with. <coughs> breadcrumbs are gonna take, if it's not open, are gonna take a long time, even if it's open. Uh, a long time. They're already stale. What do, you know? What, what else can you do to them? You know? <laughs> it's not like it's fresh bread. I mean, uh, but anyway, the Italian style. I got them for fifty cents. So I figure two of these would be bigger than their regular uh, size. So it's seven point eight ounces. That's fifteen point six ounces between the two. So I can't read from here how much that one is. But I doubt that it's probably probably less. I, I imagine. So good deals on those. Um, oh yeah, remember these that we got uh, before the dill pickle planters, uh, cashews in the packages. I think I showed you a package. They're pretty big. I'll show you. Uh, they had these marked down as well, and these are surprisingly good. I was hoping they had the brown sugar and cinnamon one uh, marked down, but they didn't. So there's 10 packs of that in the uh, here, and they're not wimpy packs. 
they're full it's full up to right there and you can see it's not you know got quite a bit in it so uh ended up they're marked down for it's upside down dollar 99 for 10 packs do you know if you bought one of these uh, at, at a convenience store gas station it'd probably be a, a, a two bucks or something uh, i wouldn't doubt that one bit at a convenience store for just one so i actually got two of these i got logan one and i got me one joy can't eat uh, any kind of nuts right now until she gets her partial and uh, denture so anyway that's that's a crazy good price there crazy cheap and then here's the other hostess uh the cupcakes pudding so yeah i'm gonna have to try one of each of these one morning and um uh, uh, i remember getting these and saying uh we still actually got a few of them and saying they were too much well obviously everybody else did too because they, they didn't sell a whole lot of them at 249 i believe that's what it was or was it two let me see it's the Ben's original ready rice. Oh, sorry. Yeah, they were two twenty nine. dollars Now I got them marked down for $1.49. I didn't buy this one last time, or either they didn't have it or something. Or maybe I do have one of them in there, and I just hadn't tried it. But I went ahead and got one more. Cause we already got quite a few. Um, but a dollar forty-nine, you can't even hardly find these on sale uh, for a dollar forty-nine. So it's smoky Southwest style. It says a hearty medley of ten different grains, vegetables, legumes, and herbs. So it's not just rice. Uh, it's it's really good stuff. I, I probably should have got more of them, but I have several, you know, of different kinds already. So I thought I got. Oh, it must be down there. We got a bunch of stuff here. Uh, I'm going to have to call it massive after handling all this and seeing how long it's taken, too. Uh, we got these Yonkers Peanut Power by Quanta. There's 10 bars in here for $1.49. And they're not real wimpy. They're, they feel kind of, they're not that big around, though. Um, we got these here. Uh, they're interesting. They're ramen, but they're little ones. Uh, this one's garlic, pepper, co Koyo brand, reduced sodium. I looked at a noodle kit they had that was a, a name brand. I can't remember what name brand right now. Uh, and uh, it was 73% sodium. And the other one they had was 60 some percent. So I didn't get those. I'm not gonna even try them with that much sodium. They looked really good though. It was like sesame, teriyaki, noodles, or something like that with vegetables. But I, I, I don't need all that. I've not been told I had to watch my sodium, but I do watch it. I got one of these for Joy and one for Logan. They're dollar forty-nine, no dollar ninety-nine, but they're really pretty full. So right here, there's quite a bit in there. Um, Joy got two of these Daniel Boone biscuit sliced country ham. Uh, they're a dollar seventy-nine. Got two of them for biscuits or either for seasoning. Some Beans. I'm gonna end up having more beans uh, out there. Okay, and this is the other flavor that we got: wakami seaweed. So we got one of the other, whatever it was. Yeah, garlic, pepper, and two of the. Uh, I see one. Figured Logan would like to try that seaweed one. Uh, there's still a bunch more down here. We got one more of these fried rice. They're really good for $1.49. Um, okay, here's we did get two of the garlic pepper. Or gar yeah, got two tomatoes. They actually had some decent tomatoes. And these things here, they're like uh, they're like um, two dollars in some a pouch, I think, or they're close to two dollars either one. At Kroger, the Swanson White Chunk Chicken. I'm going to add these to the pouches I'm going to be trying. I'm going to be trying some a Harvest Crest, the Harvest Creek uh, that I got at Dollar Tree and did a, a, a review on. They uh, sent me some. They saw my review and they sent me the rest of their flavors plus the one I tried. 
So I'm going to be trying some of those. We got garlic and herbs, 79 cents by the way, really cheap. And lemon and coarse ground pepper. We got three garlic and herb, uh, so I have one of those and they have one each. And then I'm going to try the lemon pepper. Okay, I already mentioned those. So we wanted some more of these pot corners, the kettle corn ones, they're really good and they're not bad for you. These are really good and not bad for you as well. The veggie flavor burst nacho chips. I'm trying to speed it up a little bit, y'all. I, I, I talk too much. <laughs> uh, these were 50 cents, Chi Chi's. They don't go out of date till uh, August 23. We'll probably finish those before then for sure, I'd say. We have them for breakfast burritos too. And then Joy also got this one. It says break, they look kind of like a Kit Kat. You know, give me a break. Now they got break. Okay, I mean, kind of, you know, kind of trying to say Kit Kat there in a way. Dollar forty nine for that. Um, there's I can figure these were, were marked down because they were smashed, but there's nothing wrong with them. Um, I think they were dollar. They were dollar forty nine. Oh, I can't. Yeah, and they're 75 cents, and they're Fiber One 70 calorie bars, for a birthday cake. I don't care if there's any, you know, the box is messed up. They okay, they're already out of date in June something, but these are uh, be they'll be fine. I guarantee it. Uh, so we got two of these. I knew Logan would like those, but. You know, we've had other ones that we bought there like that marked down, and you can't tell any difference from them and the ones that's not, not out of date. We've got a couple more of these mandarins in orange jello or gel. $1.49 instead of $3.19. That's how much it is at uh, Kroger. Yep, and we got some at Walmart, and they were rolled back for $2.50, so still, uh, that's still, you know, a dollar off or less. So we got two of those. Here's his other Mio. Uh, we thought we'd try this on some chicken. It's shake and bake crunchy pretzel. So I thought that would make a good, you know, ready. Uh, I'm about to get it. Uh, I got this Pepperidge Farm soft baked Newport cookies for $1.99. If y'all have ever priced those Pepperidge Farm cookies. We got some uh, burger buns. I think we'll use a uh, make cheeseburgers or something, but they're gourmet brioche for everything buns. They got everything seasoning on them. Dollar forty nine, super cheap. And we got some of these. They had some more Hostess stuff, unbelievable. Ice cinnamon, cinnamon rolls for dollar ninety nine. All this stuff that we got, where you know they're going to last a long time. And I got some frozen. Um, they've been really good. They're all fresh. And everything. Okay, here's the last one finally. I thought this was interesting. This is an actual glass uh, uh, container. Uh, it reminded me of the old Heinz bottle. But this one is it's Marcel Senchow uh, Pure Tomato Ketchup Oak Smoked. I thought, man, if it tastes smoky, that's all. I'm all for it. Only 79 cents. I got a bunch of them. I was afraid to buy. I, won't, I probably should have bought about six. I have a feeling, but if you know if they're no good, I'll I'll be glad I didn't. You know, we'll see. We've had these before. I actually did a short one time where one of them was half empty. So you got to kind of <laughs> shake them around. If they don't shake around much, then they do have plenty of uh, green beans in them. You know, that one that was funny. Uh, these were French style green beans. We've got a few, but we don't have many. Um, and they're only 50 cents so we've been buying most of our vegetables when they're you know uh, a good price at that grocery outlet field harvest i can't remember who that actually is i looked it up and it, I, I think it's like another company or something that's just one of their names and then we've had this one time before and it's really great it's restaurant grade quality craft ultimate ranch dressing y'all this is really good uh $1.99 so that's not bad. So 118.64. I've done put up a load of, you know, all the frozen and refrigerated, and I got stuff all over here. 
that is, is is really unbelievable. I mean, uh, uh, like I always say, crazy cheap prices, right? So anyway, sorry it's so long. I like to be thorough. You can watch it in two parts, but it's a little late to tell you that now. I could have made it into two parts, but, you know, I don't know. I, it, it seems like they don't do as good sometimes that way. Like somebody watched part of one and then they don't have time to watch the rest. Or, But I'm, you know, just however you can do it. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know if I should make it into two just because it's so long. But anyway, I'll figure it out. I'll probably just leave it like it is. So thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate you very much. Um, Got to get your savings anywhere you can, any way you can these days. And, you know, we won't need any of this stuff that we've got for a while, that's for sure. And I paid less than half price in most uh, cases. So a lot of markdowns this time. I like that a lot. So that's why we one reason we got so much. So anyway, thanks so much, everybody. Uh, I don't think I mentioned, if you like this, please press that like button also subscribe if you haven't already and share this out there somewhere and hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out everybody i hope you have a great day and check out the next crazy cheap prices of the next grocery outlet bye everyone and god bless